Are you tired of feeling lonely and disconnected in your relationships? Do you want to build stronger bonds with the people you care about? Look no further. In this video, we'll explore seven psychological tips for building healthy, satisfying relationships with anyone. From showing interest in the other person to respecting boundaries, these tips will help you connect with others in a meaningful and authentic way. So if you're ready to transform your relationships and experience the love and connection you deserve, keep watching. Number 1. Show interest in the other person. Showing interest in the other person is a key aspect of building a healthy relationship. When you show interest in someone, you demonstrate that you value their thoughts and feelings and that you care about who they are as a person. To show interest in someone, you can ask questions about their life, experiences, and interests. Listen actively to what they have to say and give them your full attention. Show genuine curiosity about their thoughts and feelings. Remember details about their life and bring them up in conversation. Seek out shared activities or experiences that you can enjoy together. By showing interest in someone, you can help build trust and connection, which are important foundations for any healthy relationship. Number 2. Be respectful. Respecting someone means treating them with kindness, consideration, and empathy, and not doing anything that might harm or offend them. Here are a few ways to show respect in a relationship. Use polite and considerate language, even if you disagree with the other person. Allow the other person to have their own thoughts, feelings, and opinions, even if they differ from your own. Give the other person space and privacy when they need it. Avoid gossiping or speaking negatively about the other person to others. Apologize and make amends if you do something that harms or offends the other person. By treating someone with respect, you can help build trust and a positive healthy relationship. It's important to remember that everyone deserves to be treated with respect, regardless of their gender. Number 3. Be reliable. Being reliable means following through on your commitments and being dependable. When you are reliable, the other person knows that they can count on you and trust you. Here are a few ways to be reliable in a relationship. Keep your promises. If you say you'll do something, make sure you follow through on it. Be on time. Show up on time for events and meetings, or let the other person know if you're running late. Follow through on your commitments. If you agree to do something, make sure you do it in a timely manner. Communicate openly. If you can't follow through on a commitment, let the other person know as soon as possible. Be dependable. The other person should be able to count on you to do what you say you'll do. By being reliable, you can help build trust and strengthen the relationship. It's important to be honest with the other person if you're unable to follow through on a commitment and to work together to find a solution. Number 4. Communicate openly and honestly. Effective communication is a key component of any healthy relationship. It's important to be open and honest with the other person and to listen actively to what they have to say. Here are a few tips for effective communication in a relationship. Listen actively. Give the other person your full attention and try to understand their perspective. Use I statements. Share your thoughts and feelings and avoid blaming the other person for your emotions. Be open and honest. Share your thoughts and feelings with the other person even if it's difficult. Practice empathy. Try to understand the other person's perspective and feelings. Resolve conflicts peacefully. If you have a disagreement, try to find a solution that works for both of you. Effective communication is important for building trust and connection in a relationship. By communicating openly and honestly, you can strengthen your bond and better understand each other. Number 5. Be supportive. Being supportive means offering help, encouragement, and understanding to the other person when they need it. Supportive behavior can help the other person feel valued and appreciated and can strengthen your bond. Here are a few ways to be supportive in a relationship. Offer practical help. If the other person is struggling with a task or challenge, offer to assist them in any way you can. 
be there for emotional support. Listen to the other person when they need to talk and offer understanding and encouragement. Encourage and motivate the other person. Help the other person believe in themselves and their abilities and encourage them to pursue their goals. Celebrate their successes. Share in the other person's joy when they achieve their goals or succeed in something. Be a good listener. Give the other person your undivided attention when they need to talk and offer understanding and support. By being supportive, you can help build trust and strengthen the bond in your relationship. It's important to remember that everyone needs support at different times and that it's okay to ask for help when you need it. Number six, respect boundaries. Respecting boundaries is an important aspect of any healthy relationship. Boundaries are the limits that you set for yourself and for others, and they help you feel safe and respected. Here are a few tips for respecting boundaries in a relationship. Respect the other person's privacy. Don't invade their personal space or look through their things without their permission. Give the other person space when they need it. Respect their need for alone time or time with friends and family. Don't try to control the other person. Allow them to make their own decisions and choices. Don't try to control the other person, allow them to make their own decisions and choices. Communicate openly. Talk with the other person about your boundaries and respect their boundaries as well. Seek consent. Always ask for permission before touching or engaging in any physical activities with the other person. Respecting boundaries is essential for building trust and maintaining a healthy relationship. It's important to remember that everyone's boundaries are different, and it's essential to respect the boundaries of the other person. Number 7. Practice Empathy Empathy is the ability to understand and share the feelings of another person. It's an important aspect of any healthy relationship, as it helps you understand and connect with the other person on a deeper level. Here are a few tips for practicing empathy in a relationship. Pay attention to the other person's words and body language. This can help you understand how they're feeling and what they might be trying to communicate. Try to see things from their perspective. Consider their thoughts, feelings, and experiences, even if they differ from your own. Validate the other person's emotions. Let them know that their feelings are valid and understandable, even if you don't agree with them. Offer support and understanding. Let the other person know that you're there for them and that you care about their well-being. Practice active listening. Pay attention to what the other person is saying and try to understand their perspective without judging or interrupting. By practicing empathy, you can build a deeper understanding and connection with the other person and strengthen your bond. It's important to remember that everyone has their own unique perspective, and it's important to try to understand where the other person is coming from. We hope that these tips have helped you understand the importance of building healthy, satisfying relationships. Remember, building strong relationships takes time and effort, but it's worth it. By showing interest, respecting boundaries, and using other tips we shared, you can build trust, connection, and a sense of belonging with the people you care about. So don't be afraid to put these tips into practice and start building the relationships you deserve today. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more videos in the future.